Hello and welcome to the Bikes Entry. My name's Ben and today I'm going to be showing you around this Yamazaki YM50 and if the name didn't give it away, uh, it's a 50cc bike. It's actually geared, uh, which is really great for us because the UK market has been lacking a geared 50 or a range of geared 50s. Um, so we're really excited. We've just taken on Yamazaki as a brand. There's a couple of bikes available for you. Uh, the sport bike, which is what this is. Uh, there's a uh, retro naked. There is a sort of entry level naked. There is also a Supermoto, and you will find videos and descriptions uh, on the website for all of those bikes. Um, the YM50 is a geared 50cc, air-cooled engine, four-speed, uh, 2.8 horsepower, so it's uh, it's not going to set any land speed records. But if you are 16, you can ride this on a CBT. It's learner legal, and it looks absolutely awesome. It's quite a big bike. Um, I would imagine at some point this bike probably had a bigger engine in it, and it's been reverse-engineered down into a 50. So... It's pretty big, so you know if you're uh, you know a larger person like myself, uh, you look absolutely fine on this bike. Uh, it's not really small and skinny. Um, you know it looks pretty idiot proof to be honest. It's really nice. It's available in a couple of colour schemes. It's really sought after. So um, at the moment we've got this one in the showroom for you to have a look at. But if you're interested, let us know and we'll see what colourways we can get at the time. Uh, so yes, yeah, starting at the front, 17 inch wheels, um, twin discs on this, which is one of the things that leads me to believe that at some point this bike had a bigger engine in it. Uh, twin discs, four pot non-radial brakes, um, and non-USD forks. It's exactly what you'd expect for the price point. Plastics and everything like that, like I said, probably available, I think it's in two or three different colors. You can ask us about that. Uh, we can see what we can get in at the time of ordering. Um, but like I say, they're new to us and they are really sought after, so. Um, please check for availability. Plastics are really, are really, really nice. Obviously, you can see the engine in there, 50cc. There are things that you can do to de-restrict this with a manufacturer. Comes with a year's parts uh, warranty only, uh, but we do offer some third-party solutions for uh, repairs and also covering breakdown as well. Uh, very inexpensive and definitely worth having if it's your first bike um, and you're not sure about maintenance, that sort of stuff. Looks really cool. Obviously, disc brake on the back, single pot caliper, massive rear discs, uh, and a 17 inch wheel, 17 inch wheel on the back. Obviously, you do have the option of uh, of carrying a pillion on this, but uh, at 16, you're certainly not going to be doing so um, on a, on L plates. Really, really nice looking bike. Um, quite basic, as you'd expect. Obviously, incorporated LED indicators in the side fairings, uh, normal bulbed headlights. Quite a tall screen as well, nice wide fairing. So if you're using this bike every day for school, college, commuting, that sort of thing, um, you'll be laughing. Obviously only 2.8 horsepower, so you're limited to, to 30 miles an hour, as you should be at 16. Um, but uh, but yeah, it certainly looks the part. It's a really, really nice looking thing. Chain driven, as you can see. So, you know, pretty low maintenance. Um, you're only gonna need to, to do the chain. Um, you can speak to us about service intervals and stuff like that when you buy the bike. Um, but yeah, really, really nice looking bit of kit this. Up top, really, really straightforward. You've got partially digital and analog gauges. So you've obviously got your rev counter in the center there. Um, and you've got your speed and indicate, uh, gear position indicator on the right hand side in the digital section. Uh, on the left, you've, all, you've got all your lighting control. So high beam, uh, main beams, indicators, and then obviously horn. And then on the right hand side, you've got kill switch starter and your hazard lights. And there is also a span adjuster on the brake lever as well, which is a nice thing to have. It's got a four-speed gearbox, um, so obviously relatively short pattern, um, but it's a really, really cool looking thing. This is available for you, for you in the showroom at the moment. If you're interested, we offer all the normal dealer facilities, uh, finance, parts exchange, delivery, all that sort of stuff. So if you're interested, you've got any questions, please feel free to reach out. We've got WhatsApp, live chat, all the socials. Pick up the phone and ask us any questions that you've got, or feel free to drop in and try to bike on for size. That's it from me. Thanks very much for watching. Look forward to speaking to you soon. Take care.